My name is Emily Monroe. I'm prettier than you, more popular than you, and I even smell better than you. Or at least I used to. So how did I end up here? Not that long ago, I was kind of mean. Dear Zoe, you are a she dork. Skank, pig, geek, dweeb, nerd, loser. Okay, I was a total bitch, but I wasn't alone. Being mean is a team sport, and Olivia, Cameron, and I all played offense. I mean, look at her, that hair is so yesterday. Are those shoes orthopedic? She probably reads the newspaper. She probably watches the news. Oh, great. We headed out for Zoe Bell. We used to be friends in the fifth grade before I cast her out of our social circle. And when Zoe started talking to Ethan Goodman, I didn't take it well. Ethan's sweet, isn't he? Yeah. He thinks you're totally weird, just like everybody else in this school. Emily Monroe, you s stink. That's when things started getting weird. What's that smell? It smells like leftover shrimp from my mom's divorce party. It smells like toe jam jam. I started smelling things. Bad things. Dude, your car doesn't smell so new. Oh, it smells like a turd smoothie. Eventually, I realized that the source of these hideous odors was me. I tried everything. Febreze, Old Spice, bathing in tomato juice. Then I discovered what was causing me to smell like a sweat sock burrito. When I'm mean, I stink. Oh no. Attention students, this is Principal Johnson. We need you to evacuate as quickly as possible. We may have a gas leak or a tanker truck filled with chicken manure has overturned their body. We got one. And that's how I ended up getting the hose down. I apologized to Zoe and the nasty odor stopped when I stopped being nasty. Sorry. Do you smell that? You smell nice. What can I say? Once upon a time, I was a bully. This is the story of how I changed.